Hey guys, this is Antonio. Last time on Sorry, Bioshock Infinite, we headed into the police impound thingamajig, and now we're going to head through the police impound thingamajig. And also, if I sound really irritated at any time during this video, it's because I am. Because I just played through this entire area. I actually played through an hour, made three episodes worth of videos, and the audio failed on me, which is really great and really terrible because I hate having to play through it after knowing like everything that's coming up I like having the sort of knowledge knowing of what's coming up but I'll try to recreate whatever happened again and try to talk about the same things even though it's not gonna be as good especially because I'm irritated right now Fitzroy spotted Biovox popular leader Daisy Fitzroy flies for peace oh yeah wait that's the area we were at the very beginning of the game with the, the ladder and all that oh my god I'm so scared what could we do oh poor old me little old me the Great Prophet has foreseen her end. Only he can protect us. How could he not protect us? Look at that beard, Finn. So yeah, that just whole an hour and a half work, uh, time of work being taken away from me makes me very, very, very sad. So I'm just going to run in here and murder people to take out my anger. Video games can sometimes be good for that, even though I'm going to try, especially because I died in the last couple of episodes, to not die as much. If I'm just smart about it and use my shotgun correctly, Jesus Christ. Okay, you guys are not helping my mood. You are not helping. Jeez, Scott, Scott, calm yourself. You're going to die. Let's just chill down here. Take a nice little nap. Deep breath, deep breath. It's all gonna be okay, Scott. There's no need. We don't need to show the the nice viewers angry, Scott. We need to show them interesting, smart, and calm, cool, and collected, Scott. See, just get those salts from Elizabeth. She throws things through walls. I don't understand how that even happens. And where are you? Oh no, that's the motorized patriot, isn't it? Yep. Uh, okay, how did he even get here? But what we're gonna want to do is shock shot, shock shot. Actually, hit my shots. That would be useful, Scott. Shh. Okay, but basically if we just continue on doing this it should work ex except for the dude who's shooting us from over Oh, no, where was that damage coming? Nope. We're not dying. We're not dying. We're not dying in this very first area I'm just gonna be like, screw it. I'm not making this video now I need to go calm down even though I really what I, I was really happy that was so far ahead and okay I'm gonna stop it bitching. Yeah, no screw it. I'm using the word bitching bitching not in the positive sense for it like man that stuff bitching just in the sense where I am complaining because I'm really pissed off. And how come I don't have any shotgun ammo? I guess I'll just take this crank gun and use it, but I'd rather use my shotgun and get up in the face of the enemy and completely destroy them. Either way, I'll just come up here and completely shoot the crap out of everyone and take out my anger and take out the guys in the next little showers over here. Oh, the locker room. Oh, I mean, I don't know what's room over here. They have towels and stuff. Whatever could they be? And just a weird shower room that there's a dude. I think we get another instance. I don't remember if before. There's a guy going to the bathroom as you walk in. Yeah, I think we saw that earlier in the game. He's going to the bathroom and coming. And he's just like, oh, what would do? And then he shoots him in the face. I think there's another instance of this if you don't <laughs> aggro him. Also, I talked about this before. I don't know why this room exists. Maybe, oh. That, I guess you do find things out the second time. I did not find that locked with the first time. I guess that's why this area is made. And wow, that's a big health kit from just some random dude. Even though we have tons of health kits over here that we could re-heal ourselves with. But I, it just seems really weird. They have that such empty room and the locker room has nothing. Except maybe it's just an area for them to spawn in. So let's see over here. And I believe over here is where we use our key that we found in the, uh, what's the name of the bar? What's the name of the bar? It is called, not the Drunken Oyster, the, the Night right. Shift. The Night Shift, that's what it's called. And, ooh, a box phone over here. But first, I just want to show off something great over here. We must find this bitch. This is the bitch episode because I'm going to be bitching. Daisy Fitzroy is apparently a bitch. And also, I think these people that we really don't get to talk to, also, I don't recognize. Even though we don't get to see the models of many people, I don't recognize or, un or see any of these names. The only guy with the cowboy hat, was that the... No, the guy with the other guy with the cowboy hat was against Fitzroy who was trying to kill her. That makes sense. And I guess we can pick up those sauce from here. Okay, that's weird. Uh, but there's that little novel they in they released with Bioshock Infinite. I, I don't remember it. Uh, what's it called? But I think it's all about like how the Vox Populi rise up and they, they don't defeat uh complex. Do they have a name? The Prophet's people. The 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 I don't know. And ah, uh, good old racism. So stupid. I forget what I said. I had like a whole little speech on how it was stupid that like how I was lucky because I was I basically I have this thing and I don't want it to sound racist even though it sort of sometimes comes out as that. Really? And 
thank you, Elizabeth. That five lockpick thing is a little luck. And that is a ton of carbine stuff. Like, okay, let me, I'll go back to the racism thing in a second. But, jeez, I don't understand why they don't have this bounce so much and watch. More gear that I don't need. Oh, I totally didn't know that was coming. But, and, uh, we'll go salts. We'll switch it up a little bit. It's always good to have more salts. And, uh... I don't think we really need an RPG. I'd rather have a carbine because I love using carbine. And full ammo is always great. But what I was trying to say before is, like, I won. At, I, I don't want to sound racist, but anywhere I say it, I think it comes out sort of it. And that is, like, the the same symbols as the crow dudes. And also, I believe we missed a box of foam right over our hair. And I don't even think we listened to the other one. The other one, I'll basically explain it. There's no need. I believe there's a lot. Pick right over here. Two lockpicks. Oh, and a pistol. No, I don't want the pistol. I want the health kit. And my health is full, so it doesn't matter. But, uh, the other thing basically explained where we find the key. And, like, the, it said this drunken dude was going. I was like, oh, I'm having a bad day. I lost my key. I wonder where I left it. I was at this bar. Basically, it shows you. Actually, I think we're supposed to go to the bar after and find the key and come back here, which backtracking is pain in the ass, but we got lucky and or I just knew what was coming in the game. So let's just head down here and get a little bit of story and find while we're here. Oh, there's the explanation of while we're here. And why do I... Oh! I was about to complain more because I accidentally turned down my volume. I was like, oh yeah, now the sound's not working. Ain't that great? Sorry for all the complaining. I don't want to make a complaining episode. I definitely should have waited longer. It's gonna help us. Lizzie can make a change, can't she? Sure. I goddamn hope so. Because we're sure not making anything better here, and I'm sure not making anyone's mood better by me complaining, unless you're sort of the the sadistic, is that I think that's the thing. Ooh, free lockpick and Were there like bugs in Oh god, I didn't see that's disgusting. Jesus, I didn't even notice that before. And are the bugs like Covered in blood? I never... I, I don't think they ever use this anymore in the game. I can't think of any other time they use these little bug textures. I didn't even notice that. And the founders will all be dead. And poor soul, she fell for the damage of someone else. And anything in well, we here, sure anything in here. Oh, more things. Oh, wait, we already got, like, tons of carbine ammo. Just a little bit more silver eagles and RPG ammo that we really don't need. So, oh... Like a tear to a, another version of this room that doesn't have any tools in it. Well, the tools aren't in there, then, then they must be back, back at the, the shop. shop. Well, oh, that's so cute. They finished each other's sentences. I don't think there's any turning back. Are you sure you want to go now? Well, if it's the best for us and it will get us all home, we should open the tear. Are you trying to piss me off, game? Thank you. There we go. Sorry for ruining the moment. Mommy. Well, that did something. Come on. Let's head back to the gunsmith and finish our deal. I aim to be on that airship and well shut of this place for long. That's something I really gotta get around the watching les les les, les, les miserable lesbians. It it seems good, and I think really did I just walk by that like a dumbass? Nope, I didn't walk up to it yet. I mean, uh, I wonder if there's anything that's changed in this area. Well, firstly, there's this box phone, and maybe Daisy Fitzroy can tell us what's going on in this timeline. How big of a change there's been? Oh, it's the you murder guys. The force at the beginning of a fire. For the first flame, you see them possums and squirrels running through the trees. They know what's coming. But the fat bears with their bellies full of honey, well, you can't hardly wake them up from their comfortable hibernation. We're going to Emporium, and then we gonna see what it takes to rouse them from their slumber. And as you can hear a little bit from the chanting outside, in this timeline, the Voxer, they're kicking ass. And I... It's a shame I went up and checked that before I don't need to show it again because there's nothing up there. Oh. I don't want to be a part of it. Once we get our airship, we'll be well shut of this place. 
But that sign up there where it says, like, all of Daisy Fitzroy's friends are killed, it still stays the same, and there's no, like, big changes. Actually, there's no changes at all on it, which kind of is disappointing, but, I mean, they can't change everything. I do like the little subtle changes, like the adding the box phone when we change timelines. But I'm going to end this episode at the same time I epi ended the episode before. I know it's kind of short, but I realized uh, I really don't want to make another episode right now because the quality is just going to suck and this is going to be a ton of me bitching. So take this as an I'm sorry plus a this is my... This is my day off, even though I've been not making so many videos because I haven't had the time and everything's too confusing. I need more hours in the day. And it, it pissed me off so much because now is like a perfect time. My parents going out to the movies that can make a, a bunch of like five videos and get everything done and be ready for the week. And I get three videos done and it all goes away. It's just, it makes me sad. And I guess this short video is in remembrance of those three videos and those three commentaries that you guys will never get to hear because they were the greatest ever. But it also, it sucks because it's going to make these next two and this episode suffer because I remember the stuff much more vividly and I can't be as unknowing that stuff is coming up and, and I'd appreciate it more. So I'm sorry for this. I'm sorry for the next couple of episodes. But uh, it I'll be playing through it faster. So maybe in the next episode we should be able to get through everything. Even though I don't want to cram all the... There's, okay, I'll stop talking. I'm really sorry, guys. I, I'm sorry I keep on apologizing and pissing you off. I've been saved untitled. If this audio recording screws up... Will the sun